Hey, I'm Erica Olson, and on this Music Minute, we are at Lucky Strike in Hollywood featuring Cosmos and Creature. Molly, Brandon, thank you so much for joining us. For thank us. you so much. So first things first, where do I get a pair of gold <laughs> high tops? You know, I had this vision uh, one day, we were about to go on our first tour, and I always wanted to have light up kicks from like when you're a kid, right? So I, I'm like, nobody's come up with this idea. If nobody's come up with this idea, I need to patent it right now and make light up shoes in gold. And of course, I look up gold light up shoes and <laughs> They're already made, so if you want them, you can get them on Amazon for like 40 bucks. Everything's on Amazon. <laughs> Secrets out. Once when we were young, didn't care at all. I wish I could go back, back when we were young. Yeah. Yeah. Yesterday, another moment we let slip away, slip away. But I'm here to stay Call me a dreamer But I'm wide awake I'm wide awake So who's Cosmos and who's Creature? You gotta guess. guess. <laughs> Obviously. Obviously Cosmos and Creature, oh. right? No? I mean, it's sort of interchangeable. Yeah. But Brandon is, he's a dreamer. And I'm I, out and, there. And, and I'm like I'm the dream. voice of reason. I'm just like looming. I'm just like a dark creature. Young certainly put you on the map as far as the single's concerned. Tell us about Bad Drug, because that's a new one that just came out. We had uh, a session set up with a co-writer, which at we do all the time at our apartment, and we got into a little bit of a disagreement right before, and Brandon decided he wasn't going to partake in the session. I was really angry the whole time. I didn't even like the song while I was writing it. I didn't know what I was writing. I was just trying to get done with the session, honestly. I was just trying to write a song. I didn't know what it was going to be for. I'm listening to her sing it for the first time, I was like, man, like, holy crap. I totally need to leave way more often because whatever just happened, like, whatever you channeled, like, be angry at me all the time because this is awesome. What ways have you found that you're better together than perhaps solo artists? I always say this about Cosmos Creature. We write 
so many different things for our solo stuff, but Cosmos of Future is, is like the love child of like, when you're in love with somebody, we're together. And when you're in love with somebody, you have the person that you're with, right? Your distractions kind of disappear. But I can't take you, baby, make you feel alright. What have you learned from this particular process? To be like as creative as possible and to push all the limits because at the end of the day it's like you only get one chance to put out a song to people and to present it to people and to have it capture the same energy as when we perform it live is really important. Good.